Hello people, and welcome to my new series! Whee! This is exciting. Oh, hello. Uh, basically I just decided to make my own little modded series, and installed a few mods, like mo creatures, extra biomes, just to make things a little bit more interesting, and kind of just do like a little survival-y let's play type thing, and just see what happens really, because normal Minecraft was just getting a bit too normal, I guess. But yeah, I thought I'd start off in a nice little village in a beautiful looking forest. I don't know what these big trees are, but I know that these ones are redwoods and they are beautiful. I also installed the tree captivator mod, I think it's called. Um, the, the one that basically when you chop down a tree it all comes down. So I'm excited to start using that because that should save a lot of time. Um, so I think what we'll do is we'll just start off by just raiding their village completely. So we have enough food. I think we're probably going to stay here for a little while and then we'll find um, our own little home and and get busy exploring the, uh, the new mods, I guess. Also, I'm so sorry if it's a bit laggy. Um, obviously the mods coupled with the shaders are a little bit temperamental. Um, one day I'll have a better computer, but at the moment I think my computer's doing rather well. But if it is a bit too laggy, I'm sorry. I think it's because I'm in this big forest. I think that doesn't really help with FPS. Um, so I think once I move from here... Oh, whoa. Big lag spikes. There's so much wheat here. It's just insane. It's like ridiculously... Is this? Is this? Let me just re these. It's so weird. Huh. I guess it's part of the mod. Let's go check it out. Guys, I'm so sorry for this lag. It is insane. Oh dear. Oh dear. first animal of the series. It's a nice, nice bear, little rat. Okay, so they're all friendlies, that's good. I guess this is like a, I don't know, like a tree type thingy. Oh, they're offensive. Huh? Huh? I don't know they generated structures. Actually, wait, I think I, I think they've got like these big sort of ice towers. They might have those. Where a lot of mobs live, but I don't know. Do mobs live here? Are there spawners? It's weird. What's this thing? Which is quite cute. Oh, it's like a little a little fire thing. Ooh. Hey, it's a furnace. Nothing in it. I suppose we could stay here for the night. This is weird. Hey. Okay, what? Okay, let's just... We will be gone by morning. There is nothing here for us anymore. Our ent built sanctuary has fallen. Our village is empty. The animals are gone. We thought we would be safe from the night walkers, but they got what they wanted. They got the animals. Okay. If you have to come if you have come to visit our sanctuary, I am very sorry for this. We haven't the strength to go on. It is our time to move on. We can only pray that someone, one day, will continue our work. That is, if there are any animals left by then. Okay. Doesn't seem like part of the mod. 
but I guess it is. Um, just put that back in there for a second. Sorry, I just had to fiddle with some settings because that lag was getting out of hand and I realised that my render distance was on like ultra far. <laughs> so that's probably part of the reason why I was lagging so much. Um, ah. Whoa. Okay, it's exceptionally dark. I think that's the village that way. Uh, I can't really see where I'm going. Uh. Oh god. Okay, this is one downside to shader packs, guys. You can't ever seem to see where you're going. That was weird though, right? It's cool though, I mean, you don't get that kind of stuff in like normal Minecraft, you just get boring stuff. How do I escape? Okay, I'm just gonna stay here for the night. And oh god! Oh god! Oh no! Just uh, hello, hi, how's it going? Whew! Oh, it's right in my knee! Oh. Okay, I'm gonna stay here and then we'll go and check out this weird thing. In the morning! What is this? Oh gosh! No! Safe. Might be for now. I'm really intrigued by this place. And we just spawned like right next to it, which is awesome. Wait, wait, wait! I've got an idea, I've got an idea, I've got an idea. This is an amazing idea. Where is the. There it is. Ha! Look at this. This is one of the cool things about this mod is that you can hold torches and they actually make light. So we can go in safety. Not blow up. Stay there, creeper. This is exceptionally dangerous. Ooh, dear, dear, dear. I mean, I can't... What is that? What is... No. Oh! Oh, no! Oh, they're gonna kill me! Oh, no, 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 please! No, don't kill me, please! No, don't kill me! This was a horrible mistake. This was an awful idea. This was a terrible, terrible, terrible idea. Oh no, get in the house, get in the house, get in the house. Oh no. Oh god. Oh, oh, no, 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 stay out. Why did I do this? Well, part of me thought this was a good idea to do. Please, please, please go away. Please, 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 please. There we go. There we go. Whew. Oh, you can't see me. There we go. Right, we should be safe in here for the night. Alright, let me just read this again. We will be gone by morning. There is nothing here for us anymore. Our ent built sanctuary has fallen. Our village is empty. The animals are gone. Okay, so this thing behind me, this big tree thing, that must be the ent built sanctuary. So, I know there are ents in this game. Like, they're like the big tree people from Lord of the Rings. So, apparently, this thing was built by them, and it's a sanctuary. So. We thought we would be safe from the night walkers, so I guess that's zombies and things, but they got what they wanted. They got the animals, so it was a sanctuary for animals. If you have come to visit our sanctuary, I am sorry for this. We haven't the strength to go on. It is our time to move on. We can only pray that someone one day will continue our work. That is, if there are any animals left by then. So, they were just collecting animals to keep them safe from these awful creatures that are apparently coming through this mod. What is that? Oh dear. Well, I mean, I wanted to play with animals in this mod, so I suppose the right person has stumbled upon this book. Um, and I don't mind, I can continue their work or whatever. Ah, no. Okay, the moon's going down. It'll be morning soon.
Okay, the sun has risen. Well, I mean, it's rising, so we're relatively safe. Let's just get rid of this ugliness here. Okay, some things aren't burning to death. What is this? See, this is what I thought was weird. When they said night walkers, I thought, like, zombies and skeletons, and I thought, okay, well, they're not that dangerous. Clearly... Okay, that's a werewolf. Clearly, these things are a lot more dangerous than just those, so I can understand why their little sanctuary fell. Um, but it's cool, though. It's a nice build. There are flowers everywhere. That's so sweet. But it is a bit of a mess. I mean, these kinds of things aren't really... Creeper, can you please go away? I'm trying to explore this place and you're not making it very easy. Is this thing dangerous? I don't think it's dangerous. I think he's alright. He's our friend. I mean, it's definitely a cool space. Oh dear. I mean, it definitely needs some cleaning up, but... It's not a bad place to start collecting animals. I mean, if they want me to continue their work or whatever, I don't know. But, I don't mind. Like I said, I wanted to play with some animals, so... I guess I could rebuild their little sanctuary for them. Here they are. Ooh! Okay. You're not very nice, clearly. Well, to start off with, we're gonna need some tools. So, we're gonna need some trees, which means we're gonna need some wood. Okay, trees, trees. That's a big tree. They are a pain to cut down. These ones aren't. Okay, this is cool. Oh, we can do my tree captivator thing. Look. Ooh. Oh, I think you might need you might need a tool to do that. There is a chance that you. Yeah. Look at the little pillow. Oh, it's a panda. Oh my god, can I tame these? I've made a little list of things that I can very easily tamed, and pandas and foxes are on the list. I just need to get some raw turkeys and some bamboo shoots and I'll be able to tame these guys. You just both need to just stay here, just while I collect some stuff. Ooh, a bee. Ooh, I don't like bees. I do not like bees. Okay, let's just build ourselves some basic tools. Okie dokie. So, uh, I think I can probably just build down from here and get some stone. So I've learnt one thing. Um, don't stay out at night because it's incredibly dangerous and you will probably die. Oh yeah, that should be enough for now. I'll just make some stone tools. So what I want... What do I want? Uh, I just don't know where to start. Well, I guess I'll speed this bit up so you don't have to watch me work, but um, let's get cleaning! Um, I did see a sheep over this way and I'm very, very tempted just to kill it to get some uh, wool so we can make a bed because the night time is not a safe place to be. Definitely not. So we have one sheep. That's good. Uh, okay, there's a brown sheep this way. Please give us two, two wool. Two wool. Two. One. No. I don't want to have to wait again. Oh no, I should have... And if I run around for long enough, I can find myself a sheep. No, this is far too dangerous. What am I doing? Go back home. Get in our house. Get in the house. Get in the house. Okay, this is turning out to be a bit harder than I thought. We haven't even tamed an animal yet. Yeah. Does anyone see a sheep? Anywhere. If you see a sheep, I will run for it. Okay, screw it. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna get us a sheep. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. Right, there's a bee, but that is the least of my worries right now. 
Sheep. Sheep. Werewolf. Zombie villager. Sheep. Sheep. Please, just one sheep. Just one. I asked me. Oh, I thought that was a hole. <laughs> oh my god, what is that? What is that? I'm on fire. Oh god, I'm on fire. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Is this okay? I will be fine. I just need to find one sheep and bury myself in its wall. Water. Ooh. No! Okay, so I came this way and then I died here, right? Did I die here? I did! Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Do I have all my stuff? Pretty much. I think that's all I had. I had ca Yeah. Everything's great. Oh, ah, you're burning in hell. Or at least you were. Continue to burn in hell. Yes. Whoa. And I got an achievement as well. Oh, Ents. Hey guys, how's it going? Maybe these are the Ents that built the structure. Ah, mysteries are unfolding. Okay, so the main priority now is going to be find another sheep, because I need, because I'm dying and I'd like to be able to sleep and not worry about death. Ooh, there is a turkey. Turkey, I'm sorry, but I need your blood to tame some animals. I'm sorry, turkey. Where am I going? What the hell is that? Okay, that tree is home to a lot of evil creatures. We are not going anywhere near it. <gasps> Sheepy! No! I'm sorry, I have to kill you. Great! This is good. Where's my bread? Did I eat it all? Look at his little- Ah! No! Why? Why does everything want to kill me? The Ents don't want to kill me. Which I'm quite happy about, because I have a feeling they're quite strong. Where is my crafting table? Ugh, yes. We are missing some wool. No. My recording software decided to stop recording. So, basically, <laughs> oh my god. I cleared away all of the rubble that was around here. I still need to clear away the grass, but I think the best way to do that is gonna be with water buckets and just collect up the rubble um, at a later date. But right now, I wanna tame some animals, at least before I go. So, and to tame the panda, we need the sugar cane, which I got, and to tame the fox, I think we need the raw turkey. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. <gasps> Okay, we need to name it. We need to name it. I didn't even... Okay, this is this is an unideal situation because I haven't actually thought of a name. So we will call you Gerald Dean. Gerald Dean will be your name. Hey! Hello! Okay, awesome. We have a Gerald Dean and then we have a fox. Hello. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, uh, and naming the fox. Um, Max. I don't know why. I just. I don't know. Okay, we have. Awesome. How do we make them? Um, can we like grab them? Can I pick you up? Ah. Oh, okay. This be an issue. I can't actually move the animals anywhere. <laughs> Oh no, stay in the water. Stay in the water. Hey, hey, stay. No, oh, Jesus. Stay. Max, no. Oh, it's night time. Okay. We need to sleep. We need to sleep. Okay. Oh my god, no. No. Uh, Max, wait. Stay. Stay. Max, you stay in one place. Jesus. Okay, well maybe we can just leave them around here. I don't think they're gonna go anywhere. I think we're probably... <gasps> Have I got him? I think I got him. Stay right there. Don't move a muscle. No, Max, no! Ugh. We're just gonna leave you here. And you're not gonna run away, and you're not going to escape, because you're my first animals. Geraldine and Max. 
There's another fox over there as well. I want it. I need it. I don't know why I'm taming these animals when I have no idea what I'm going to name them. Um, Alex. That'll do. Hey. Okay, great. This is awesome. Okay, so I think I'm going to call it a day on this episode because my recording software is being a bit of a boob and it won't record past like five minutes. So I need to find a way of fixing that before I continue. But I think in the next episode we will tame some more animals, figure out a way of moving these ones without a lead and clear away a lot of these flowers and fill in some of these holes so they're a little bit more safe. Try and get some torches around um, so that these night walking evils will not keep killing me and yeah I could just continue to explore the mod I guess I mean this has been kind of unexpected um, I'm gonna have to kind of rethink some things now that I've found this but I don't know I think this has worked out quite well I'm happy I have animals they're over there they're probably gonna run away there's Geraldine Max and Alex I think they're so sweet Let's pray that by the next episode they haven't run away Give me a thumbs up if you're enjoying the series so far and if you're excited to see more of it. Um, I'm gonna, I'm kind of excited to see more of it and see where it goes. Um, but uh, I don't know, I guess it's up to you guys. But yeah, for now I think I'm gonna go and I guess I'll see all you people next time. So I hope you enjoyed this episode, I will catch you on the flip side. Goodbye.